All right, hello YouTube. All right, so uh, this video is going to be uh, about another GoPro product. It is the small uh, GoPro Shorty uh, little telescopic um, tripod that fits in your pocket. Okay, now for one, I've hardly ever used this thing. And uh, the slide mechanism up and down, it's got a, a two or three stage extension. But it's so loose that when you put your, your camera on it, the, the first stage just slowly like just drops right down, okay? So uh, this is my fix, my repair. Um, just going to show you guys what I did. It does work. It's probably not going to last that long, but I hate to throw the thing away. And I'm sure a lot of you guys have experienced this. So uh, let me continue into the video. And I'll show you what I did, and hopefully it works for you. You can uh, gain a little more uh, footage or, or filming out of it. But uh, here's what we got. All right, YouTube. Uh, if I can make a short and sweet video of this um, GoPro Hero 7 Black. I bought this. It was probably uh, September of uh, 2020. At a terrible time. We're not going to talk about that. But anyhow, it came with this shorty grip right here, right? And I've never really used it. Um, I've, I've used it a handful of times, put it that way. But what happens with these is so cheaply made, when you extend it, okay, if you can see it, this usually, this usually drops. Uh, sorry it's not doing it now, but it's just automatically just goes now i played with this a little bit okay so what kind of a, a, a telescopic thing is that when you set it there and this used to automatically drop down to here okay you can see right there it's very loose right here now if you look at this ulanzi one right here okay this ulanzi one is you have to really wow that is well, wow, that's pretty pretty tight right there. Okay, that ain't going nowhere. Look, you have to put some pressure. I wish I had a scale. That works really well. So what I'm going to do, um, I played with this a little bit earlier. I don't want to throw this thing away. It's not the best thing, but it's actually pretty cool because if you look uh, compared to this, it's very small. It's 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 quite a bit smaller. Okay. So what I'm going to do is uh like I did earlier, I'm going to use a heat gun. Okay. So we'll, we've got the heat gun plugged in right here. But first, uh just a clamp, just a little ideal hose clamp. Okay. So let's put that on here. You could probably do this with a zip tie also. I bet you that would work. So we'll get this ready. Let's put this on here. A fuel line clamp would probably be the best because that's got a, a nice smooth inner. Um, it doesn't have all these serrated edges. It's got a nice smooth uh, piece. You guys that uh, work on stuff, you know what I'm talking about. So let's try this right now. Okay, get this off of here. Don't want to get it too hot, but we'll use this. I just didn't want to throw this uh, thing away. It's actually a pretty nice little handle being so small. I just don't really use it that much because the thing used to drop all the time. But just for the hell of it, let's try and fix it. That's pretty hot. It's on high. So if you guys got one of these and you're interested in saving it, might work, might not. But I did this earlier with a little bit of, uh, you know, a small set of channel locks and gently, gently uh, crushed that little plastic. And it worked pretty good for a while. So here we go. Okay, so let's move this up. Hey, it is hot. It is hot. Okay. 
and you don't want to go too too tight but we'll go snug you know I'm gonna bring this up all the way it don't even matter okay just snug we'll let that sit for a minute you could actually blow it with uh, compressed air to cool it off which I might do but uh, we'll just give it a minute we'll do this in I guess you call it real time okay snug it a little more but I guess ultimately it needs to be cooled down so let me go inside I'm going to uh, put some cold water on it I'll be right back all right so I'm back I cooled it off with some water now keep in mind uh, when I undo this clamp here um, there's still some water on this plastic and that equals lubrication and uh, that will change the way things work okay so let's see what this does now all right so we'll push this down yeah there we go you know what um, I should take this off but that is very very stiff whoop there's my cover but there we go. So that's a pretty good fix. So anyways, for what it is, it's not a really fancy uh, handle or anything, but it is pretty cool. So that's all. So if you guys got something like this or your, your thing just drops down every time you use it, pretty simple fix. So thanks for watching.